What's good guys, it's Zach, hope you all are doing well. This here is a very, very highly requested video. You guys wanted me to show you how to get the Pixel 2 launcher set up on your home screen. Obviously I don't have it right now, but I wanted to do this step by step with you guys. So let's go ahead and get started. All of the things that you will need will be linked down below in the description, so make sure you check it out. But the first thing that we want to do is head into the Play Store and get Nova Launcher. All right, so now that this is installed, the fun can begin. All right, and then it's gonna bring you through this Actually, no, it's not. It usually brings you through like this little setup thing, but it hasn't done that for me. Maybe it's because I had it installed previously. But anyway, it'll probably pop up here uh, in a little bit. So let's go ahead and get rid of a few things here. Let's go ahead and get rid of these icons because we're not going to need them. Those folders rather. We can go ahead and head into these settings here. We can go to desktop. We can go ahead and get rid. I, I say go ahead a lot. We can get rid of this page indicator. And then we can also get rid of the dock because uh, for the setup, we're not going to need the dock gestures and inputs would be next I guess we can go ahead and ugh, I need to stop saying go ahead so much we can swipe up here and then uh, there it is see this is this is what's supposed to show up when you first install Nova launcher but let's go ahead and skip that there I am again with go ahead go back into the settings we can go into gestures and inputs swipe up and then we can do app drawer for that all right so there's that we can swipe up to get to our app drawer there are a few things that we're gonna have to adjust for that since we skipped the whole setup thing. Let's go into app drawers. What you're gonna to wanna to change here if you end up getting stuff like mine. Let's get rid of the card background. And then let's see, swipe to open, swipe indicator off. We should be good to go. There we go, that's more like it. All right, so there's the app drawer. Now let's get to the Google search bar. All right, so for the Google search bar, there are a couple of things that you can do. Uh, if you don't want to install anything extra, you can use the one that's built into Nova Launcher. So it's that one right there. If you wanna know how to find it, just go to widgets. It'll be at the very top because it is built into Nova Launcher. Go ahead and long press and drag it onto your home screen. You can resize it and uh, do whatever you want with that. So let's go ahead and take this one right here and we can drag it to the bottom because that's where it is on the Pixel 2 setup and we can long press on this, go to edit and we can change everything from here. So we can go ahead and uh, make the corners rounded. We can use uh, this one right here and that's pretty much it. Or you can actually, yeah, you can do the transparency as well. You can do 10 or 15. Let's go ahead and do 10. I keep saying, it. let's go ahead. All right, so there's that. But the only thing, the only reason why I'm not using this one um, is because the uh, voice search icon is not on the Pixel 2 setup search bar. So we're not using that one, but if you don't mind, then you can go ahead and move to the next step. I'll show you guys the one that I am using. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to widgets and I'm gonna swipe all the way down to the bottom because it is a super widget. So there we go. We can use this one because I'll just resize it anyway should be ready to go. One thing I did forget to do actually is go to the settings here, go to desktop and do the desktop grid. Now for the Pixel 2 setup, I believe it's something like eight by five just by glancing at it. But for this setup, for some reason, I like doing nine by five. So you can do eight by five, nine by five, whichever one doesn't really matter that much. But as you can see here, it did resize my widget. So there we go. Now we can tap on this one. Now the one that I use is actually from Pixel 2 Zoopers. It is a paid application and of course you have to have a Zoopers widget, but uh, you can actually get it from Trident 3 for Zoopers. So if you have any of these, um, then you can just get the one from there. But the reason why I use the one from Pixel 2 Zoopers is because it looks cleaner. It's a little more high res, it's not as fuzzy looking. So there it is, Pixel 2 default. You can tap on that and then we can resize it to whatever we want. For my particular setup, I'm doing uh, 112, but uh, it might depend on your, your current setup, your current layout. Uh, you can do whichever one you want, but for me, I do 112. So there's that. It is a little large, but it works for me. So let's go ahead and go back into the Nova Launcher settings. We can go to the look and feel and we can change the icon theme. I'm using Pixel Icon Pack. I've actually been using that for a long time, so I've stuck with it. Uh, you can use any icon pack you want, of course. And then I can go to desktop real quick, go to icon layout. And I, I like to resize my icons, so let's do 110 for now. And then, as you know, on the Pixel 2 setup, it is part of a dock, so it's not using any icon labels. So there we go and you can swipe up and we can go ahead and add some applications. All right, so there are my applications. Of course, you can use whatever applications you want, but let's move on to that widget that appears right about there. It's a reminders widget. It's also got some weather going on there. A lot of people are wondering how to get that. It's really easy. You can use um, Trident 3 for Zuper or Trident 3 for KWGT. Normally, you'd want to use KWGT because of the weather. It's more accurate. Uh, Zuper's not really supported in that aspect anymore, but um, 
I use Zuper because the one for KWGT, at least for me, doesn't really work too well. You can use either one though, doesn't doesn't matter, just as long as it works. It actually doesn't even need to be that big because the widget itself is very small. So let's go ahead and use this one. All right, so Trident 3 for Zuper and it is called, there it is right there, Pixel 2 Calendar. Let's enable this. All right, and I have mine set to display the upcoming holidays in the US. Now in terms of scaling it, again, you can make it however large you want. Let's go ahead and just stick with that. Of course, we're gonna have to move this around a little bit. So this is how you can scale the whole thing, move it around and uh let's go ahead and move it right about there that's fine that'll work and we can go back to the home screen and we should be good to go it should resize itself there we go there it is you can resize it to look however you want it to uh, if you want to make it a little larger you can do that let's go ahead and do that real quick maybe something like 100 why not all right so that'll update and uh the next thing that you're going to want to do actually you can just leave it like that and you're good to go uh, so, you know, thanks for watching guys, but if you want to get a little extra, if you notice on the Pixel 2 home screen setup, there is a swipe indicator right above the icons. I can show you guys how to get that. It's pretty impractical, but uh, you do get that look nonetheless. Uh, also, if you guys would like to get, let me get rid of this real, real quick. If you guys wanted to get Google Now on your home screen in Nova Launcher, then I do have a video tutorial on how you can do that links down below. And also, for those of you that are using a more current Galaxy device like an S8 or a Note 8, you can also get the Pixel Nav bar right here. I'll also have a video tutorial on that linked down below so you can leave it like that let's go ahead and do a little extra and get that swipe indicator so let's go ahead and get to widgets here there's another zooper we can do one by one we're going to we're going to resize this one is going to be very small so there you go it's gonna be about that big tap on it and then this one I actually just randomly found in Huck for Zuper um, of course you can use Huck for KWGT but it's really easy here in Zuper now basically I don't remember which widget I found it in give me a sec all right well it's actually right here I'm using that little arrow right there in this whole entire widget I did show you guys how to get rid of the elements in certain widgets in previous videos uh, but let's go ahead and go to layout all you have to do is get rid of these three elements and you're good to go so get rid of these and you're left with a tiny little arrow let's go into this here and we're going to have to move it towards the center you probably can't even see this I'm not too sure it's really small let's let's do zero to keep it in the center and then let's scale it there it is all right so you can see that now uh, let's do 90 just to see if that'll work go back to the layout go ahead and swipe down here and you should be able to rotate it 90 degrees all right so there we go looks good so far and then you can adjust it how you want um, but let's go ahead and just see what this looks like on the home screen so it should update itself if you want you can also get the material design status bar using an application that i will also link down below in the description so check this out it's pretty cool uh you've got the material design it looks just like it does on the pixel pretty much and you can also change it however you want let's go ahead and try to force this update real quick go ahead and press back should change it should change this time there it goes um, it may be a little high up there we can go ahead and move it down a little bit there we go maybe maybe eight will do just just for kicks all right let's see how that looks all right so that's pretty much it for this setup uh, again links to everything down below in the description if you have any questions go ahead and comment I'll do my best to answer each and every one of your questions but that's pretty much it guys I hope that this works out for you um, if it does go ahead and hit that like button if you would like this wallpaper I'll do my best to link it down below in the description as well uh, the pixel 2 uh, screenshot that you guys see everywhere I'll also link that wallpaper in the description as well so that's pretty much it I hope you guys enjoyed this video it was pretty uh, pretty uh, spare of the moment type thing I, I didn't really plan to do this video today but uh here it is hope you guys enjoyed if you did feel free to hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you haven't already that does it for me i will talk to you guys in the next video and thank you so much for watching enjoy guys